Nyx is now sitting on the throne of hell and everyone has lost their powers. Let's talk about King Spawn number 31. A new ruler, a new world, a new direction. Uh, I really liked this comic. This has been, I think, I think this is my favorite issue of King Spawn. <laughs> um, most King Spawns get around, I think, like a 7 or 8 out of 10. Um, this one's going to get higher than that. Um, let's talk about it using my space system. Story, pacing, artistry, characters, enjoyment. Each category gets a score between 0 and 2. I'm going to give the storyline a 2 out of 2, man. I loved it. You got this punk guy in the beginning here. And Spawn, so they've lost their powers. But they're, they don't, if you remember at the end of Spawn 350, you had that power level rating at the end. It was just a one. You're like, oh no, one. So this guy thinks he's a big, cool, badass guy. Yeah, like he looks like, looks like Jake Gyllenhaal or Ryan Gosling or one of those. <laughs> Why is Jake Gyllenhaal in this comic? Um, and Spawn just comes and beats the crap out of him. He's now a vigilante. So let's take a look at how, how cool this is. I gotta tell you, I was pumped for this. Look, all comic books, once you start getting high enough in the numbers, some people might not like this depowered spawn thing. Look, it's not gonna stay forever, obviously. Once you get long enough in comics, remember Superman dead, comes back four different Superman. Superman, then he's electric blue for a while, then he's got a red and blue, right? There's, there's you know, long haired Superman, right? You get long enough in a run of a character, you start to explore different facets or different themes or different just like ways to tell the story. Spawn being this vigilante is kind of neat. I love the fact that he's just like sitting there Al with his like mask and he's got chains and stuff. He's got weapons. Remember, he was a special agent, right? He was the best killer agent ever. So obviously he's gonna be awesome even if he doesn't have the spawn powers. The cool thing is that everyone's depowered so everyone, it, it, if all these angels lose their wings on that they can't fly so it's like they've been reliant on these fly, uh, on flying and we're gonna get the gunslinger i'll review that today too this is so cool because now spawn has become awesome even more awesome because he was already awesome as a regular human um he's trying to get information on um uh, on uh, miss blake which I, I, I guess this is i'm not sure if this is like wanda's mom or something um I was out of spawn for a while, so I, that's who I'm assuming it is. And these guys have taken her. Um, and he's he's threatened a guy with this like vampire. So he's like, if you don't tell me where she is or where you took her, I'm gonna sick this vampire guy on you. Um, that's kind of the story. And then you have, everyone is just scrambling. This is sort of, I still like the storyline here. I'm giving it a two out of two, but this is one of these like, okay, we gotta set up the new world now, right? So now we've got these different factions. What are they gonna do? They're trying to figure out we've lost our powers. What, where do we go from here? Um, you got one of these panels, which is pretty funny. Um, yeah, I love the storyline here. It's great. Pacing two out of two, man. It's friggin' fast paced. All spawn. I, every spawn comic gets two out of two for pacing. I mean, they're all very fast paced. It's always fighting big, bold pages and like, you know, so there you go. Um, for the art, I'm giving it two out of two because uh, I love the art here. Um, spawn art is always, spawn art is always going to get a 1.5 or a two. Uh, pacing and and and, um, and art are always going to get high marks in Spawn. Spawn is got, still got that '90s mentality of like yeah, big splash pages, double splash pages, crazy art. You know, like the chains are whipping everywhere, the capes all over the place. Like even when he's normal, the chains are everywhere, <laughs> um, and it's always lots of fighting or whatever. So that's always going to get high scores. But yeah, I love the art in this issue. Um, while I'm on the topic of art, I do want to mention my channel sponsor, BeardedShirts.com. Legionnaire shirt. Look at this one. This is a print all over, so it's prints on both sides. Um, Bearded Shirts is awesome. They always have sales on. So check them out. The link is in the description below. And if you become a member, if you become a Legionnaire, a channel member, then uh, you're actually entered into a draw to win stuff from Bearded Shirts. Uh, there you go. They always have sales on, so make sure you're checking them out. Uh, characters, I'm going to give it... I guess I'll give it a one. I mean, look, it's just Spawn and these other guys. I, there's not, there's not, I mean, Spawn is awesome in this. He's really the only character we're really getting. So there's not really much to evaluate. Like I like Al Simmons anyway. I'll, obviously I wouldn't be collecting Spawn if I didn't. So that's it, that's it for that. Enjoyment factor, two out of two. It's, it's awesome. I'm giving this a nine out of 10. I, I like it, it. This was a friggin' great. This is probably my highest ranked um, King Spawn issue. Uh, I, lo I like this new direction. I want to see where it goes. It's interesting. And look, if you don't like it, there's going to be people who don't like it. That's just the, that's just how it goes. 
it's not going to be forever. You're telling you, there's not going to, it's not going to be like spawns ever going to have powers again. It'll go back. But for now, just to make it interesting, they don't have it again. Take any character, Batman. Oh, his back's broken. He's not Batman anymore. Oh, and people always roll their eyes. Oh, uh, yeah. But when Nightfall was going on, you're like, holy crap, what the heck's going on? Like, it's not Batman. You know, oh, the clone saga. Oh, there's all these clones now. Oh, the clone saga is so terrible, except that everyone loves Spider Verse and there's 400 Spider Mans now. I remember when Ben Riley came out, everyone's like, oh man, who's this Ben Riley? This is so stupid. It's a clown. Ah, clown. Clowns are so trash. Eh, why is there more than one Spider Man? This is so trash. Eh, 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 eh. And now there's 4,000 Spider-Mans. Everyone's like, yeah, I like the 450th Spider-Man. In that Spider-Verse movie, I paused it, and there's a Spider-Man in the back that looked like, you know, like whatever, a rabbit. That's my favorite Spider-Man. Like, it's just, it's just like, so, so again, it's like these things come and go. So there you go. All right, everybody. If you enjoy my space system, please like the video and subscribe. And that's it. Until next time.